we're using eight different instruments. A complete set of old Italian instruments and a complete set of Sam Sigmund instruments. Two violins, viola, and cello. See, we're not going to tell. Yeah, we're going to see. We're going to list all the instruments on the record, but it's not going to say who's playing what when. It's a, it's a perfect mixture of of instruments from Sam Zygmuntovich that he made each one for us and early Italian instruments. I mean, really, can you tell the difference from looking? At them? My recent acquisition here is a Samuel Zygmuntovich violin. It's based on a Guarneri del Gesù model. It was completed um, in the spring of 2002. This is an early Strad, made in 1686. The new instruments are all made by Sam Zygmuntovich, which is the violin that I play most of the time. It's a 19, 1999 copy of my teacher, Oscar Shumsky's Stradivarius, the Rode Strad, which is a violin that was made in 1715. I'm lucky enough to be borrowing uh, the Panette Guarneri del Gesù, uh, which was made in 1737. And this was the violin that Isaac Stern played for, for most of his long career. Well, this is my Montegazza, made in 1796. Um, really, I think one of the, the greatest violas, uh, old Italian violas around. And, you know, all the other guys were getting, uh, they were all getting uh, Sam Segmatovich to make instruments. Uh, David, of course, being the first one with the cello. Um, and I'm being the last, and Sam just recently, actually, uh, September of 2003, he, we, were, we talked about it for a long time, and he made a copy of, essentially a copy of this viola. This cello is, is a Stradivarius, what they call Stradivarius model cello, and Stradivari in the early 1700s basically perfected the forms of the violin and cello, they've never really been improved upon. So Sam made this cello after the Duport Stradivari of 1711. And this is a Guadagnini from 1754, which is of a much, it's a much smaller model cello, so you can see the size difference. I think we wanted to just leave it uh, ambiguous uh, so that people would have to try, maybe try to figure it out, try to guess it. And I, you know, I'm listening now to these playbacks and hearing both instruments lined up side by side. I can't even tell. Okay, I'm sorry, I forgot which cello I'm playing now. Because I'm, I'm holding both of them. Okay, 